Mark Skinner, Manchester United women's head coach. How does that sound to you? That sounds the best. That's the best. I mean, to have uh, the privilege to, to be involved and to be the head coach of a, a team such as Manchester United, it's, it's a, a wonderful day in my life and, uh, and one that I'm going to cherish for the rest of my life. Yeah, imagine you're in a position now where you just want to get down to business and get on with the job in hand. Absolutely. Look, I know some of the players uh, and for those that I don't yet know, I've been watching a lot about them um, and listening to the right stories and the right kind of things that I need to. And for me, we have to continue what the great work's already happened, already been put in place for some of the foundations. We have to continue to do that because, you know, it's uh, this club... It, it seeks and, and wants success, it, it, it's throughout its history and we want to create that with the women and continue the, the great work already done. Last time you were in the WSL with Birmingham, fourth place finish, FA Cup finalists, do you feel like you've got unfinished business in the WSL? Absolutely. Um, for us now to have a platform with a club like Manchester United, we, we know where we've got to be, we know what we've got to do, but you know we left abruptly and, and now it's time to come back and really set our goals and our targets to where this club needs to be, which is challenging for championships and, and making sure that we're in finals and winning finals and stuff. That's where we, we're looking to head. And that's very much one of your ambitions then, to, to win titles, win trophies and have that winning mentality here at United. It, 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 it's in the hallways here. Everywhere we walk, it's, it's, it squeezes success out of the people that walk through the door. The fabric of Manchester United is success. The fabric of Manchester United is playing attacking, exciting football. So for me, that, that's what I'm here to do. That's the whole reason I've moved my family back over to England, to do that with this club, because it inspires me when I walk around here and just speak to, the, to even the, the cooks earlier who, who brought our food. It's, it feels like home. And that, that's a wonderful feeling for, for me to be part of. And this is the special club is the reason we returned this this club is the reason we returned you'd yeah, think if it had maybe been another club you maybe wouldn't have been you had been a bit more reluctant to come back to England because it's a big decision isn't it to move your family all the way across the Atlantic again huge look we had a real bad time during Covid as everybody did and you know I didn't see my family for nine months and that was a big divide big factor in kind of where we looked at what was our next options but when this became available there was no other option I get like tingles down my spine because it's, it has an energy that, and an aura. And that's been created way before me. I just want to add to that. Yeah, and imagine you're eager then to get onto the training pitch and have an impact with those players. I cannot wait. Honestly, I haven't coached for two weeks. I cannot wait. My energy, it's going to be, it's going to be bubbling. They might have to contain me a little bit, especially if I have a coffee in the morning. And already knowing, having spoken to most of the players, and, um, and, and the feedback being this week is that they're really excited to get to work with us, but I can tell you they're nowhere near as excited as we are to get to work with them. When the season comes round, it's Reading at home, then it's Newcomers Leicester away, and then it's the Champions Chelsea back at home. Three big games to really get your teeth into. That's what we're here for, big games. This, this, this club wants to be in the beast of games. It needs to be in the beast of games, so for us, Every game is different. The, the beauty of the FAWSL is that you are tactically challenged a lot more. Um, you know, Reading have, have been a con constant throughout the time that I was even at Birmingham. And then Leicester obviously have been really successful last year. And then you bring the champions. So I'm looking forward to every one of those challenges. And I know the players will be prepared and ready for each one of those challenges too. The fans here at United are a very passionate bunch. They'll be delighted to see you in the dugout. I imagine you'll be equally as delighted to be out there in front of them. They're the best part for me. Apart from working with the players every day, I cannot wait to speak to them. I cannot wait to, to perform in front of them, um, but also make sure that you know, we give them as much as we can so they enjoy coming to watch us play football. Well, Mark, congratulations on your appointment here at Manchester United Women. We're all delighted to have you here and the very best of luck to you and your team for this campaign. Thank you very much. and I can't wait to, to get out on the field and work with everybody and, and be part of this wonderful family because ever since I've been here, it's felt like that. And for me, it's going to be a special place and hopefully we can build special things here.